Thank you very much, everyone. And good morning, Buffalo and Western New York. It's tough to follow Sam Radford, I have to tell you. I wish I had half of his energy. Bishop Malone, you know, Bishop Malone is actually new to Buffalo and Western New York. He comes from New England, from the state of Maine. But he has assured me he is no longer a Patriots fan. Because if he was, we'd send him back to Maine. No, just kidding, Bishop. I want to give a shout out, first of all, to some excellent schools in Niagara County. DeSales Catholic in Lockport. DeSales, where are you? St. Peter's in Lewiston. Niagara Catholic High School and the Catholic Academy of Niagara Falls. Four great schools in my Senate district. I myself went to and graduated from Ascension School in the city of North Tonawanda. Bishop Gibbons High School in North Tonawanda, both of which, unfortunately, are closed today. They are closed because of the same reason we are here today, because parents with fiscal challenges couldn't send their kids on to those schools and they had to close. All of my colleagues in Western New York, you heard earlier from Senator Tim Kennedy, Senator Mark Rosani, who has a representative here today, Senator Pat Gallivan, who has a representative here today, and Senator Senator Mike Ransenhofer and Senator Kathy Young, all of whom are represented here today, supported and voted for this legislation not once, but twice in the New York State Senate. My colleagues in the Assembly in Western New York are on board with this today, but we have to carry this message statewide, the importance of education in Catholic schools, other Christian schools, Jewish schools, all the schools all the way across New York, from the tip of Long Island up here to Niagara Falls. We are encouraged by the growing bipartisan support of this legislation. There are elected officials, not just in the state legislature, but at the local level, like my very good friend, Erie County Clerk, Chris Jacobs. Chris, stand up and take a round of applause. Chris Jacobs, who's here today to support us. What we really need we have this growing support here in Western New York. I know that Senator Marty Golden, a sponsor in the Senate from the city of New York, is trying very hard to get his colleagues on board. What we need is pressure across this state. What we need is you to call your friends, your relatives, in other areas of the state. There are rallies going on just like this in other areas of the state to get that momentum going to Albany. But like always, it starts right here in Western New York and in Buffalo. And it starts with each and every one of you. I was elected to the New York State Senate a long time ago when I was a lot younger. And people would say to me, how did you reach this goal in your life at such an early age? And I said, it was very simple. Two loving parents and the Sisters of St. Joseph. And just like your teachers today, just like your teachers today, they are striving to give you the opportunities that your parents, your grandparents have had, and even greater opportunities than that. So thank you all for being here. Thank you for moving this legislation, this tax credit, so important to every young person in New York State. It all began because of your efforts. And when the governor signs this bill, it's really to the credit of each and every one of you. So thank you all very much, and let's go Buffalo.